What's up everybody? Here's another video for you guys. As you can tell, it's a Kimber. It is the K6S double action, single action. What we have here in the box is the pistol itself in a Ziploc bag. Soft storage case. Over there. Of course it's unloading. Lock. Actually came with a speed strip. It's a DeSantis gun hide. Uh, their model 016-1010. So that was in there. Um, I got some card about some boots. The instruction manual, as usual. Kimber thank you note. Some more uh, oil for the gun. Cool sticker. Got to get those stickers. Kimber NRA. More Kimber stuff here. Go look at all this. Just a car flight discount stuff. And just more cars. Then we have some uh, fiber optics. All right, so that's enough of that stuff that all came in the box, right? We're here to see this bad boy in action, right? So to start off with, it is a four inch barrel, okay? Four inch barrel, fiber optic front sight, adjustable rear sight, elevation and windage. It, like I said, it's double action, single action. So single action, double action, okay? Um, this is a, it holds six rounds. You guys can see there. It's got the finger groove grip walnut. Uh, let's see what else. That's pretty much it. No, it's got the Kimber logo on one side. Oh, this is actually a target model. So I don't know if you guys can see the Kimber logo. And then it's got the uh, right in there for the target. Chamber in a 357 Magnum. It will shoot. 38 special and 38 special plus P. The trigger feels pretty good. It's very easy to stage because you get that second click when the cylinder re locks again. Because the first click is it unlocking, second click is it locked, and then go. Um, so that is the pistol. I mean, look at it. It's just it's just really sleek. It's different. The cylinder is they flatten it off. In between, instead of doing the actual like half circle cut out, like oval cut out or whatever, it is flat. Brushed aluminum or brush, whatever you want to call it. So yeah, um, we're going to be shooting the uh, usual 38 special and 357 Magnum out of it. And let's get this party started. So these are going to be the 158 grain truncated flat nose. I'm shooting first, 38 specials. Pretty good target loads. So I'll show you another thing that you don't notice in most revolvers. So on the side, when the cylinder's closed, you can see the rounds kind of like on the side there through the gap, but here you can't. So, which is kind of nice, I guess. Makes it look really slick. All right, here we go. So I'm gonna do six shots, single action. I mean, double action. So we're gonna do that again. Had to adjust the sights a little bit. Here we go. Double action again. But yeah, I'm liking the trigger. It's got a pretty good trigger on it. All right, let's go do some single action.
Thing lax is pretty good. I like it. Even those plus P rounds are still pretty good. I'm digging it. Let's try some of these semi, these uh, semi wild color hollow points. Some of those. I can use it still. I can use it still. Oh yeah, she's spot on now, mister. Spot on. Let's try some 357 mag. Oh, real quick. I meant to, I meant to uh, mention this before, so we are clear, okay? This is the holster that I did a video on that fits five of my other pistols. She fits. A little bit of movement. Can't pull the trigger all the way. And of course, this holster, it doesn't, it doesn't bother me at all, but somebody's going to freak out about it. But the trigger guard ain't, ain't, is not uh, covered up. So the trigger is exposed, but you can't pull the trigger. You know what I'm saying? All right, these are, uh, shoot some of these here, 357 mag wild cutters. Try it like them. I mean, single action, double action, it's spot on, man. I'm liking it, trigger's fairly good. You can stage it. Fairly good, to if you really pay attention to it for, you know, target shooting. It is a K6S target, so. It actually does. Yeah, I'm liking it. I'm at, so if y'all liking the videos, make sure you subscribe, hit the notifications button, because I'm actually going to work on um, speed loaders for this. That actually worked for this and a few other pistols. So make sure you So here goes some uh, pretty good uh, 158 grain XTP 357 mag. So I should like, so, so far it's pretty good. I mean, the trigger's nice and everything. I like it. Oh, you can de definitely tell the difference in those. A four-inch barrel, though, man, it'll let you know quick. And it's not even that heavy. All right, so I got I got a mixed load. So the nickel is 38 special, and the brass is 357 mag. Target load. All right, so we got three water bottles set up down there. So first shot is going to be the truncated lat nose. Second shot, that's 38 special in there. Second shot's 38 special. Uh, semi wide cutter hollow point. Then third jug is going to be a 357 Magnum plus P with a 150 grand XTP. Let's do it.
dovetail there for that 357 magnum it's like the grips are nice my hand fits perfect in there it's almost like it was made for me you know what i mean uh, sights adjustable i did have to adjust them a little bit because i was hitting high and left so i adjusted them low so everything's flush and the top of the sights cutting it cutting the target in half um you can stage it hear that so one click two and then fire me that's just it's nice i like it once again you got the k6s target engraved on the barrel right there uh 357 magnum on the other side of the barrel and you got the kimber logo down there it's nice i like it made in yonkers new york usa there we go folks if you like the video make sure you like subscribe notifications button for be notified of more videos released Share if you want to, whatever, don't care. I just like doing it because I like doing it. And uh, stay strong out there, everybody. Even though... I can use a cell.